Did you know that people who are obese or overweight have a high chance of dying from COVID-19? Hello, my name is Dr. Chinwe Iwujaja. I'm a public health researcher and in this channel, I bring you useful health information that will help you make the right health decisions and help you live healthier. So in today's video, I'll be talking about how COVID-19 affects people who are either overweight or obese and why they are likely to die from the disease. So early in the pandemic, it was clear that certain persons were at risk of developing severe COVID-19 when infected with the virus. Amongst these persons are those who are advanced in age, those who are overweight or obese, those who have hypertension or diabetes, or those who have certain lung issues like asthmatic patients. But today's video actually focuses on those who are obese because there is an overwhelming evidence to show that this category of people actually have a very high chance of dying from COVID-19. So studies have shown that people who are obese or overweight are likely to be hospitalized when they are infected with coronavirus. And when they are hospitalized, they are also, there is a high chance of them being admitted in intensive care. And out of those who are admitted in intensive care, there's also a high chance of them dying from the disease. Also, 90% of deaths from COVID-19 are from countries that have high rates of obesity. So countries with low rates of obesity actually also have low rates of deaths from COVID-19. So you can see that this trend further supports the fact that people with obesity are likely to die from the disease. And even in those countries with low rates of deaths, the people dying in those countries are mostly those who are either overweight or are obese or have other underlying conditions. So why why is this the case? Why do people who are overweight or obese tend to die from the disease? And actually there are so many reasons, although not so clear, but there there have been multiple reasons or multiple explanations to this. So people who are obese actually have impaired immunity. So the condition itself sort of impairs their ability to fight off diseases so they sort of have lower immunity than people with healthy weight and so they are not able to their body is not able to adequately defend or protect them from the from the virus also excess weight can impair one's breathing so the lung capacity is actually limited in people who are obese or people who are overweight and we know that coronavirus attacks the lungs and ravages the lungs and damages the lung in the process leading to um, low oxygen supply. Imagine the virus affecting the lungs of someone who already has an impaired lung function. The reason is that people with obesity actually also suffer from chronic inflammation. So there's some inflammation that is already ongoing in their body. So when the body is trying to defend itself from any invasion like virus, bacteria or toxins, inflammation happens, chemicals are being released in that process. Okay, so that's, that's what inflammation is about. And so that happens like on a regular basis, constantly in people who are obese because there are fat cells that are being released, okay, and the body is trying to take care of the dying fat cells or the dead fat cells. So all of this contributes to the inflammatory process. When the body already is undergoing this inflammatory process or response, we now have another virus that comes into the body and so further increases that inflammatory process. So it's more or less like there's excess immune cells that are being released you know at this point and now this can be counterproductive because these immune cells could even begin to attack the cells of the body the tissues and organs and cause further damage we also know that obesity increases the risk of having other underlying conditions like hypertension diabetes and even asthma so you could see that 
all of this could actually even play a role in worsening the, the disease in, in, in such persons. So it's just important to note that being obese or overweight places you at a danger zone should you get infected with COVID-19. So um, what you need to do basically is to try to shed off some weight. You can visit your healthcare provider for proper advice on, on how to do that. The essence of this is just to prevent you from either dying from obesity itself, because that also is a risk factor on its own, or dying from COVID-19 when you are infected. And again, try as much as possible to um, go get the COVID-19 vaccine if you have access to it, because that will be very helpful for you. Remember, the COVID-19 would prevent you from falling sick would prevent you from being hospitalized. So why not go get it if you have not done so? So if you need more of this kind of videos, kindly press the subscribe button and then press the notification bell so that each time I release a video like this, you will receive the notification. Thank you so much. And don't forget to always stay safe and always stick to science. Bye-bye.